parts to my spirit Amen. than cater to my flesh. Amen. 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 And uh, some of the reasons why you can have all that other stuff going on behind the scenes. But hey, I digress. Amen. Okay. Amen. So we're going to continue on with what? The administrator of the kingdom part three. All right. And I, I'm, I'm expecting God to really open up our, the eyes of our understanding. But I'm going to try to go back through a little bit. Just try to reiterate. And uh, when we started, I was just sharing something the Lord gave me about being brought out of dead religion. You know, we've, we've been brought out of tunes and rules and regulations and rituals and customs. You, you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. How many know that's some of our background? Mm -hmm. That we were bound yeah. by the religious system. But thank God. Thanks be unto God yeah. who was delivering me. Delivering us from those things. And, I, look, and most folks get kind of a little bit of a little hissy fit because they think I'm attacking something. Mm. I'm not attacking you. I'm attacking yeah, the systems yeah, right. that have kept people yeah. immature. Yeah. And have not caused them to grow up in the things of God where pastors can't go into the deeper things. Yes, and talk about the mysteries of God. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Somebody had uh, shared with my wife at the Sunday said that... Um, she had been in church for a long period of time, but had never been exposed to teaching, strictly teaching, no preaching, just strictly teaching. And uh, it's a bit of a culture shock. But they know that in their spirit, it's necessary transition. <laughs> so there will be a controversy in your head. When truth comes, there's always controversy. Trust me. Anytime you come in contact with truth, truth is being spoken and declared. You, it's, you know, you can feel it around your head. You know, there are spirits that's assigned to your intellect that will bind you, call mind control, yeah. and try to limit you and keep you from understanding. That's why you have to live from the inside out, from your spirit, man. He said you bear witness with your head. That's what he said. He ain't got nothing to do with your head. We need to be rescued from my intellect. <laughs> okay, let me go on. Stop messing with y'all because y'all ain't, ain't real reciprocating with me tonight. So, I, I, know, I know I'm trying to help us out because we're supposed to be spiritual people. Amen. And, and, and this is why I'm going this route with the administrator of the kingdom because he's going to help us yeah. mm -hmm. to be sensitive mm -hmm. to the spirit of God and desensitize us as it relates to the, who we used to be Amen. in our former birth. So last week we talked about the promise of the Spirit. 